Hello. Hello. Uh, well. I am Anisia Uzeman. And I'm Saul Williams, and we are the directors of Neptune Frost. And we are about to dive in. <laughs> to a few films here in this closet. I see some cool stuff that I'm not taking, but that I love. Or shit that scared the shit out of me when I was a kid, like Videodrome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <I'm sorry. laughs> Thought of ingesting all of these DVDs into my stomach. Do the right thing. Yeah. You can take it? this. Yeah. Go ahead. I have a crazy story with Do the Right Thing. Mm -hmm. Because I was an exchange student to Brazil uh, when I was 16. And the day that I came home after being gone for a year, my cousin was at JFK. Um, to meet me at the airport with my parents. And, you know, my parents were like, we're so happy to see you. My cousin was like, yo, wait till you hear this new shit. <laughs> he was like, there's this song called Fight the Power and this movie called Do the Right Thing. Oh. Yeah, it's this summer of 89. And, um, and so we, we walked to the car with the luggage. We put the, the luggage in the car. And, like, we, you know, I've greeted family and all that. And so finally we're like, can we turn on the radio? And they turn on the radio. And as soon as they turn it on, you hear, fight the power, fight the fight. And, yes. and so we're, I'm back in New York for the first time in a year, and it's the first song that I hear on the radio. And I'm so moved that like I'm looking out the window <laughs> and tears <laughs> rolling down my eye. And either that night or the next night, I went to the theater to see Do the Right Thing. The Mirror, Mr. Andrei Tarkovsky. I do think that it's with The Mirror that I started to be really, really um, passionate about um, what an image, uh, what a framing, what a movement, a camera movement is. Also the fragmentation of the story um, and the layers, the time layers, uh, how he goes through times in his films in general and in this one in particular. Um, the opening scene of this film is unbelievable, unbelievable. It's a one shot. And I know that there is one moment where you see the, the, the boom. <laughs> 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 you see, I've seen this film like, I don't know, maybe, I mean, a lot. Can I hand you something else? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you might have something to say. Oh, my God. Pasolini, Pier Paolo Pasolini. Arabian Nights, my God. The decors. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> the, 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 I mean, the framing, the depth of field, the, yeah. the number of people you see, and also discovering those beautiful faces. And he had also a relationship to actors that, it, that it's so... Extraordinary actors. Right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, to bring... Um, I don't know, a life, a, a, something that is very uh, uh, pure. There's a more contemporary film that I'm super happy to see here. It's Time oh, by Gary yeah, Bradley. Yeah. Um, documentary wow, yeah. that is just brilliantly shot, brilliantly edited. Um, mm -hmm. it's, it, it, it really blew our minds and, and what a aside from the fact that it's that it's such a touching story and 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 follows you know such wonderful subjects and what have you um the way that the film comes together is the editing the editing yeah is is really just magical this is a a mutual favorite of both of ours um i mean when i say a mutual favorite yes in the mood for love um but really the I would say everything that Wang Kar Wai has done. Yeah. He has a beautiful relationship to music as well. Yeah. You um, were saying the other day, it's like he sometimes has film like jukebox. It's jukebox. kind of like a jukebox musical. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you know? Yeah. I mean, one of my favorite scenes is you talk about Hendrix in, uh, in Happy Together. Yeah. 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 Um, <laughs> Movement. And he, actors, he's dancing. Oh my God. Oh, and he has the <laughs> most beautiful actors in the world. In yeah. the world. Did we speak about um, Gibril Diop Mambetti? Yeah, master. Master yeah. of African cinema from Senegal. He's going into um, folk tales and mythology to, to I think, um, 
extract um, some some very beautiful metaphor um, for the present, and I think that's also something that is very um, African. All right. Well, all right. Uh, thank you so much for uh, for all those movies. For yeah. all of these films. Yeah. It's really a pleasure to be here. It's super exciting for us, and. Um, it's yeah. a dream, actually, to be here. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, thank you.